I'm uh, Doriana Fuxas. Uh, we have um, an office in Rome with uh, Massimiliano, my husband. And in Rome, in Paris, and in China, in Shenzhen. Uh, from many years, mm, quite uh, 45, 45 years. We are, not, not me, but Massimiliano does architecture. <laughs> say the, the right, we are complementary because we are very um, very different. We are not the same person of course and he is a man, I'm a woman and so we are quite different, you know. But we can work together and and maybe we need to work together. For me it's that for him I don't know you you'll ask him. <laughs> The airport um, is, the, I think, it's the first time that an architect designed um, not only the exterior but also the interior of the airport. And so this was the, the way we did uh, the same skin outside and inside, and all furniture, quite all, of course, not the most important things for security and so on, but all, even uh, luggage uh, arrival. And so we did everything. And it's strange because for this airport, Chinese uh, people, our clients, ask to have the copyright. That is not, um, no, it's uh, quite new for China because normally they don't care about the copyright. But in this case, it was not that they care. They don't want that we do anywhere else the same pattern, the same idea. That is quite strange. The, the view must is very important. The view, but not I don't know. Is this in this case? Of course, it's a beautiful view because it's on the square with the, the trees and it's fantastic view. In Rome, it's on the on, on the Tiber. But the the need we have is to see outside, even if it's only the sky, and it's important. You see the sky, the the clouds, the um, the stars. This I mean, I can't. I couldn't live in a, in a house that is inside, always looking in, even if it's a garden, but inside. Uh, Jean Prouvé uh, furniture, I love, I prefer, and uh, I, uh, we have in Paris, we have in Rome, uh, we try to to, to buy when was possible. Now it's impossible. <laughs> it doesn't exist anymore because only only museums. Has. Because we um, we started, you know, when we started to to buy was not very new. Jean Prouvé. After that, we did a Biennale in 2000, and it was um, less aesthetics, more ethics. And we thought that one of the the person that um, was better representing this thing was Jean Prouvé. And we present these uh, pavilions for uh, emergency that um, you could um, build in seven hours, maybe for earthquake or for war. And, the, the, uh, and what, this was uh, 2000. In 2001 was the cent um, hundred years of his uh, birth. And so they started to do exhibition and he was new, like never before. And so you can't buy anything more. 